Hello people, Sean C6 here. And this is going to be the first tutorial on the channel. So lots of times new creators will come on and they will ask how to use world edit. And to just explain it is quite complicated and even the warp we have created on the server here is a little hard to understand for someone that doesn't know what they're doing. So I figured I'd make a quick video just outlining the basics for new creators and creators. So new creators, they can do slash slash wand and slash slash set. So to begin with, you can go slash slash wand and it'll give you a wooden axe. This is used to select the region you want to modify with world edit. So like it says, left click set position one, right click set select position two. So left click, right click. So we have this area between the two pieces of blue wool selected. And then we can use the other command, slash slash set. So it sets the entire area that you selected to the block that you choose. So if we wanted to do stone, we can either type stone or use the block ID where it says one in brackets. That's the block ID for stone. Everyone has a block ID. So we can go slash slash set stone. And it does the whole area that we have selected as that block. So if we wanted to set it to something else, say wood it does everything and sets it all to wood now one other way instead of using the wand there is a way I actually prefer you can stand in the area and type slash slash position one that'll be the same as your left click and you can stand where you want for the second one and type slash slash pus2 that will be the same as your right click since we already have them selected it will be the same thing now we can go pick a block so orange wool would be 35 colon 1 not slash like it says there set 35 colon 1 so that will be orange wool that covers everything for the new creators. That brings us to what the creators can do. One hour later you'll get more commands and everything. So the commands they can do are slash slash set, replace, copy, cut, paste, and they can undo. So the same thing as with uh, the new creator. You can select the area. either way you want and then set it to something let's say stone again just to make it easy so we can set what we could do to show this I'll put some dirt in here So the next thing they get is a replace command. So instead of setting the whole area, you can replace a certain block within it. So it'll be slash slash replace. And then you type the block that you want to replace. So we want to replace dirt and then the block that we want to replace it with. So let's say that orange wool. So it'll replace all the dirt with the orange wool. Now while we're at it, we could do slash slash undo. If if it didn't look turn out like we wanted or it didn't look good, slash slash undo. And it goes back to what it did. It's the same thing. 
with uh, any command. So if you did slash slash set and you didn't want to do it, just slash slash undo and it removes what you just did. Now we can do copy, cut, and paste. So whatever's selected will be what is copied or cut. And wherever we're standing on it, when we type the other command, is where it will paste. So I'm standing right in the middle and on the block right in front of it. So if I type slash slash copy, when I paste it, it'll be the exact same location from where I was. So I'll stand here, so it should appear right here and that should be right in the middle. When I do slash slash paste, so exactly, right in the middle and right in front of me. And it's the exact same thing. Now if we stand over here, just to get this as an example, slash slash copy again, the same thing is still selected, but we're on the left corner. So if we stand right here, it should paste over here, and this will be right on the left corner of the block. Slash slash paste again, and exactly. Now if you wanted to move something entirely, not make another one of it, instead of slash slash copy, we can use slash slash cut. So it works the same way as copy, wherever you cut it is where it'll paste it. So let's say we want it to paste from this corner slash slash cut so this will remove it and then now it'll paste from the right corner over so slash slash paste the same as when you're using copy and there it is just like I said before with any of these if you didn't mean to put it there or it didn't look good or anything you can do slash slash undo and it'll undo any of the commands. So that'll disappear. If you didn't want to cut it, slash slash undo again, and it'll place it back. So pretty simple. Those are all the basic world edit commands. Feel free to ask anything when I'm online also if you didn't understand or just want some clarification. Uh, I will get into more complex commands that VIPs and them can use. It's a lot for one video, so I'll probably have it split up, but you can do things with world edit like all of this. This is all fairly complex brushes and spheres and smoothing and overlaying and replacing and all that. So I'll get to this stuff in future videos. But for now, that's all, and remember, have fun.